Grandpa's Waltz came to me many, many years ago uh, from the playing of the great Paul Van Arsdale. I met him back, I think, in maybe 1983 uh, at Augusta. Uh, Sam Rosetta was teaching a class uh, which I attended, and Paul Van Arsdale was, in, uh, was uh, kind of a guest artist, and uh, I remember him playing this tune, and I thought this was such a sweet, gentle, happy tune, and uh, it, I, I sort of forgot about it until a student, uh, one of the Sandridge regulars, Mark Higgins, uh, heard it on Spotify, much to my surprise that I had recorded it. <laughs> I, not my surprise that I recorded it, <laughs> but that, uh, that it was out there somewhere. I had recorded it for uh, a commercial many, many decades ago. And Mark uh, heard it and, and reminded me of the tune. It's, uh, it's super sweet, really uh, gentle tune, happy, uh, but it is also uh, challenging in uh, the, the ranging ideas that I present. I think will will give you a, a, a really nice uh, workout. Uh, there's some big jumps, descending bass lines. The backup is super fun and it's not too hard. You could keep it relatively simple uh, with uh, the arranging ideas that I present, uh, but some of the baseline ideas will challenge you just because of the physical distance that you need to travel on the instrument. Um, but have a great time with this one. It's really sweet and the effort will be well worth it.